Local union bus operator claims the Topeka Metropolitan Transit Authority is overworking its drivers and wasting tax dollars in the process. KSNT News reporter James Ryan looks, takes a closer look at the allegations and why Metro leaders are surprised by the claims. According to a new report, some bus operators here on the Topeka Metro feel overworked and unheard by management. But General Manager Susan Duffy says that report doesn't mesh with what she sees on a daily basis. Bus operator Doug Wright says drivers are feeling overworked after the Topeka Metro extended riding times. But they didn't really make a commitment to add more employees, more bus drivers. So just extending hours stretches all the existing employees a little thinner. Wright presented a report to the Board of Directors Friday morning. The report claims Topeka Metro is wasting tax dollars. Today, I came in and worked for three hours, got paid for three hours, but I only drove the bus for two hours. I drove two different buses and I drove three different cars back and forth. Metro bosses say this practice of switching drivers in the field saves money. That saves us um, labor hours which are always more expensive than just a drive time um, by about $12 an hour. But General Manager Susan Duffy says she has a hard time believing that all drivers are unhappy. My office is about 10 steps away from the driver room and I'm out there visiting with them. They know I have an open door policy. Duffy says she would like to have a meeting with the board and all bus operators in the near future, but points out that contract negotiations between them and the bus operators union begins in April. Reporting from the North Kansas bus on the Topeka Metro, James Ryan, KSNT News. And some viewers may recognize Wright as a former mayor of Topeka. He served in the 1980s.